everybody, it is me, Life Simmer, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 2. So currently, we are in our new home for those who did not watch the house tour. You missing out because we moved and I kind of am in love with the house. Um, anywho, what are these three doing over here? Sisterly bonding time, I guess. Playing The Sims, busting out. Oh my god, that was my childhood right there. I still have that game to this day and I want to play it now. Um, but I am going to go ahead and have Amanda bake up some stuff. For those who, once again, did not watch a couple parts ago, we actually um, bought a bakery. So I think we're going, oh, some visitors have arrived to welcome you to the neighborhood. Then we're going to go ahead and serve a sweet welcome cake. We will do... Ooh, mint and chocolate cake. I'm not quite sure if I would like that, but we're gonna go ahead and do it. Oh, it's Mary Sue Pleasant. Aye. We're gonna go ahead and invite her in. We're gonna, I know, I, I, I love really how it says a bunch of people from the neighborhood have come to visit us and it's like one sim. We're gonna go ahead and greet Mary Sue Pleasant. She is from the Pleasant family and she's pretty freaking cool. So we're gonna come over here and greet her. Her life's a little messed up, um, but isn't everybody's. Let me really quickly, let's turn this down a little bit, shall we? Eh, eh, it's probably fine. Okay, um, okay. Okay, she's thinking about Cassandra Goth smelling flowers. Same though, same. I'm also gonna have Don come over here and work on the engine before he works on the body. Ooh. Oh, right. oh my gosh, I just got blown up with messages. Um, but we are going to, let Amanda, did you serve the cake? I feel like you didn't, Amanda. I'm gonna have her come over here and serve the mint and chocolate cake, or the mint and chocolate cake. Yeah, that was right. And here it is. Oh, it's actually really, really cute. Okay, so I'm gonna have the girls. Oh, Piper isn't doing so well at school. Okay, skipping school or not doing homework equals feeling, feeling guys, feeling, failing grades. I don't see any homework in here, so <laughs> about that. We will definitely have to work on that, but um, Piper is gonna come down here and eat. The girls are probably gonna stuff their faces with this because it sounds oh so good. Oh, and I didn't even have to tell Rose. She's already coming. And Don. All right, here he is over here working on the engine. Hopefully, oh my gosh, that looks so smashed up. That looks so smashed up. But I definitely think working on the engine before the body is probably the way to go. Definitely. All right. So, oh, Amanda's eating out here. All right, girl, all right, do whatever you want. And I think we should probably invite over our husband, right? And I think get the Paregos. Um, where's the phone is the real question. I need to make a call, but I don't know where her phone is. And she's gonna come over here and call a Sim. Mortimer, our husband, <laughs> which we are not with. How sad are we? But yes, we are going to invite over Mortimer. Okay, Mortimer doesn't own a phone. Um, I guess he's not coming over in this part. Never mind. Maybe I'll have Rose. Ooh, <gasps> scandal. The scandal. Okay, what we're going to do is we're actually not going to call Mortimer up because we is young. We is looking for a man. We're going to invite somebody else over and we'll kind of, I guess, leave it on the DL and not tell Mortimer. You feel me? Because, I mean, yeah. <laughs> uh, this guy is super hot. Benjamin Davis. Ooh, Benny boy. We're gonna go ahead and invite him over. Oh, he's not home. Come on, you're hot. Come over. <laughs> and I guess we should actually... Ooh. Ooh, let's throw a party. A New Year's pa a bash? Whoa, 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 whoa. A New Year's bash? Did I see that correctly? Because that sounds freaking amazing. It wouldn't really make sense. So I guess we're gonna actually host an anniversary party that's adorable and we're doing that i would assume their anniversary is coming up i don't know so we're gonna invite over some people it'd be a little awkward inviting over like remington and lauren since we're kind of in love with both of them but we're gonna invite them over anyways who cares and let's see who else shall i invite apparently no definitely not nicholas um oh avery miller and Alec, 
who else? Cassandra <laughs> Goth. I mean, I guess we should invite over the Goth family as, I mean, they're our family. Scary as that is. And it's looking like that's it. Cool. The guests are all invited. Break out the refreshments and the latest tunes. It's party time. Okay, you know what? We have all these simoleons. And by the way, a lot of these simoleons are going to disappear because I have to build the bakery and dining place and also give Mortimer and Cassandra goth money as well. So, with that being said, it will definitely deplenish a lot. But we're going to decorate for a party really quickly. So, this music is bopping, by the way. Yes, honey. We'll do this one. These balloons right here. These are pretty cute. Put them right in front of the door, I guess. And it's not like snowing out or anything, so we could possibly host it outside. It would make a lot more sense since we have a, a lot of room out here. That's what we'll do. We'll host an outdoor party, shall we? All right. Um, let me see. I'm a little picky, but... <gasps> Firecraft. Whoa, what is that? Dino Dinko's oh I'm a mess right now crackers crack pop bang Ooh, I don't know what these are but I want them where do you put them do you put them like inside the house okay that cannot be safe that cannot be safe but I'm buying them anyways if somebody dies not my fault all right they're like two opposite ways but that's fine we will also get a party chest right here, costume trunk, and Sims can switch into little costumes and it'll be super adorable. Okay, um, let's get some champagne because that's always good. Toast and all that good stuff. All right, put that there. We will go ahead and get a juice keg as well. Okay, and let's see. I've never hosted an anniversary party, so I'm kind of like, I don't know. I'm like, I'm curious on how exactly that would go. Oh, that is adorable. This table right here. Look, it has like the little carrots. Oh, that is so cute. It has like carrots, celery, cauliflower, and broccoli and all that stuff. That is so cute. And then we will put out some sparklers and also some boxo blast. Those sound fun. And oh, these are so cool, dude. I have never. Oh, I mean, I have used these a couple of times, but I've never seen like these right here. I have no idea what those are. Okay, and then I will also put down the little, what are these called? Box of noise, whatever those are. We'll put them down and I think that should be it. We'll go serve the food. Ooh, yeah, we'll be fine. We're gonna go serve the food out there. And Amanda or Rose actually come out here and clean up. Don, you're fine. I love how he's looking real young and Amanda's looking real old. <laughs> oh, he's reading to Willow. That's adorable. Oh, and he wants to woohoo. We will definitely woohoo tonight. That's happening. Oh, and he needs to actually head up here, use the potty, take a shower, and then I guess come down here and eat some of this food. And we have salad, gelatin, and turkey. So I'll have him grab some salad. Oh, that salad is so cute. And it's party time. Woo! We are going to start off with some food. Okay, he's running to that toilet. Look, she's... How are you going to be disappointed over those? How are you going to be disappointed over those? Mm-mm. Um, hold, hold up, hold up, hold up. Is this legal? <laughs> is this legal? I know in the Sims 3 University, it's like you get juiced off this stuff. Um, But you know what? Have some fun. Okay, that was that was gross. But I won't say anything. Have fun, I guess. <laughs> oh my goodness. She's gonna go ahead and drink some as well. Or actually, she's gonna drink it from the tap. There she goes. She's just drinking it from the tap. She doesn't care. And Benny has the day off. Good for him. Um, what, who? Oh, she's about to pee herself. Elderly. Elderly woman for you. And the girls are gonna come over here. Ooh. Dress everyone. <gasps> that is so cute. We're gonna dress up. Everyone. Somebody just peed themselves. Good job. Everyone's gonna come over here and dress like... Oh, I don't know. I'm actually gonna come over here and 
spooky, skeleton, sci-fi, superhero, super villain. Ooh, that's kind of cool. Uh, animal, bumblebee, cow and a bunny, everyday hero, firefighter, cowboy, beach theme, hula dancer, mermaid, and pirate. This is custom content right here. It's super cute though. So I think I'm gonna have everyone dress as, it's not really summertime, it's actually almost winter. So I think we're gonna do animals. <laughs> Why not? This is not an animal costume. That, this is a lie. What is this? It's outerwear. Oh my god, what a mess. What a mess. It's literally just outerwear. Not cool, not cool at <gasps> Dawn just aged up. I had no idea. Okay, um, okay, they did dress up. <laughs> they did dress up and they're all like mascots. I mean, if that's what you're into, sure. And Don aged up and he's actually a really cute old man. He's really cute, actually. Oh, and we can pick some people to age up with us. I don't think we have any friends. Oh, there's Benjamin Davis. He can stay young. But yeah, I, we don't really have any friends. Like, I'm tempted to age up Cassandra. But she's not on here. That's lame. Okay. But yeah. I'd like to live more than a mediocre life. Oh my gosh. Okay, Don. I know, buddy. Life has been a little mediocre for you. So he's going to come out here, I guess. He needs to shower and stuff. Can you guys let him out? Jeez. All right. He's going to head downstairs. This party is so dull. Like, there's nobody good here. Oh, he's kind of cute. He has, like, nice hair. I like that. Everybody out of the bathrooms. It's, like, literally a snoozer, but that's okay, I guess. They're elderly. Turn down for what? They're gonna go ahead and light these. I have no idea what these do. I wanna know. So, I mean, Amanda's dressed up like a mascot, but I mean, hey. Hey, Willow. Okay, that's really creepy, a green witch. Hey, Willow, is Rose available to talk? Why, well, yes, she is. I'd love to get into the witchery. The witchcraft, I think that'd be fun. I know. Piper isn't doing so well in school. She, there's nothing I can do about it right now. All right, here we go. Here we go. Everybody's watching. Oh, those are actually pretty cool. Those are actually pretty freaking cool. All right, we're going to go light the other one. Here we go. That one's pretty cool, too. Oh, okay. And they just leave, like, this big pile of... <laughs> of like debris. Uh, let's go ahead and make a toast. Let's toast to John and everybody will come over and like enjoy it and toast to him as well. I guess it's his birthday and also our make-believe anniversary so we might as well come over here and celebrate it in our little llama costumes, shall we? We shall. See, Mary Sue is our friend. Oh, did Dawn? Oh no, Dawn didn't dress up. All right, who, who dressed up with us? Mortimer? Remington, okay. All right, and this is one lame party. Awesome. All right, Rose. Okay, now there's about to be like a fight. Can we not? I guess there's like a big crowd of people. I've told freaking John to eat for like hours now. Go eat. The girls are going to go light some sparklers outside. How are you? She's going to go shower. This one's going to flirt in here. If everybody could leave the kitchen. Thank you. Thank you, everyone, for actually listening. I'm not going to bust a move. We won't be weird. We won't be weird. We'll try not. And then we're going to ask him what he wants and what he fears and just talk to him a little bit. And these two. Oh, there they go. In their outerwear. She's, like, not even holding it. Oh, there she goes. Okay, this is weird. My want have a party my fear death of amanda okay i mean i guess it's sweet but i mean i get it she's old and all but geez how cute are they this is actually a really cute picture there i took a little screenshot of it it's really cute the girls are just over there with their sparklers they have school tomorrow so that's obviously what they're celebrating and this party's a snoozer Woo! like the rest of my life Okay, so, um, she's going to, I guess, tell him a joke. Benny's, like, talking to him as well. How are you, Benny? Benny's getting freaking old. No, he's young. 
Oh my gosh. This dog's gonna like live forever. Okay, same. Okay, Don. Are you pregnant? Go ahead and take a shower, buddy. Go take a shower. And then he's probably going to head to bed as he is a little old man now and he's probably exhausted. Um, girls, please. It is Willow. Willow, you can go ahead and get out of that bed. No, everybody's sleeping in the wrong bed. Okay, hold up. You go sleep there. Yeah, that party wasn't very enjoyable. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. We'll be fine. No. Okay. Aw, she's super sad about it, but it's okay. It's the thought that counts. And did he leave? I hope he didn't. I don't think so. Oh, nope. He's leaving. Ugh, whatever. I think maybe we'll go on a date as we are still pretty freaking in a pretty freaking good mood. So maybe I can ask him on a date. He'll probably reject it considering I don't really know him all that much. But oh, community lot or at your place. Let's go to a community lot, right? Everybody can stay home. Everybody. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go on a date with this guy. His name's Alec. He seems pretty cute, so why not? We can actually go to the My Muse music and dance studio, but I don't think we're gonna take him there. Maybe we'll go there on our free time. I think um it is 10 p.m. We'll probably be out for a while. Um Let's go downtown. Let's go out to, let's go to, hmm, I'm not sure exactly actually. I'm thinking we should just go bowling, right? That'd be fun. Yeah. Having troubles finding a date? Bring yourself down to Rodney's hideout. Yeah, we're not going to do that. Um, we have a date. All right, we'll go to Midnight Flows as it's probably gonna be midnight while we're there. So, um, yeah, we'll head here. All right, guys, and here we are at the flow. It's actually pretty cool looking. Um, we can configure these, cool. And let's see, here's Alec. He is a popularity aspiration, which is pretty cool. He wants to slow dance with us. Ooh, have a pillow fight with us. Ooh, talk to us and go to eat with us. So I guess we will do exactly what he wants. We will be seated and we're gonna sit, sit, sit at a booth and not the bar. Oh, apparently he doesn't like somebody. That's not good. Yes, come on over and join me. Oh, we're not even gonna sit at a booth? Lame, I like the booth. I want a booth. <laughs> I really want a booth. Are you serious, dude? The booth is so much cuter, but whatever, I guess. Uh, we are going to toast to him. She may find a little creepy, but we're doing it. Hello, Vivian. We are going to go ahead and do Chef's Choice. Let's see what comes out. It's probably going to be like, <laughs> probably like a piece of lettuce. Yeah, yummy. Let's go ahead and let's see. Is it already out? My goodness. Okay, it's spaghetti, and I have no idea what that is, actually. It looks like a pork chop, chicken, something. What is it? I have no idea, actually, but we're gonna go ahead and scarf it down. Should steal a bite of his food. Yeah, let's go ahead and steal a bite. That spaghetti looks pretty freaking good. That's mine now. Mm-hmm, she liked it. Cool. So we're just gonna eat that on up. And he re Oh, what is this? Sing duet? Oh no. This is about to happen. This is happening. Sorry, I have no intention of making a fool of myself with you. Don't take it too personally though. How are you gonna say that? But if you... You're gonna say you don't wanna make a fool, yet you wanna sing a duet with me? Boy, you make no sense at all. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and pair a bill of 32 simoleons, super cheap. Oh, no, 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 no. I want it. I want this date to last longer. We're gonna charm him. Hurry, oh my gosh, no. <laughs> hurry up, hurry up. Come on. Okay, we're almost there. Oh, we got more time. I was gonna say, stop it. <laughs> I was gonna be really sad. Okay, we're gonna come over here. Oh, and he has a crush on us, which means we might be able to sing a duet. 
Uh, I actually already charmed him, so I think I'm going to try to give him a friendly hug. Okay, cool. We're gonna go over here and sing with Alec, come on. Really, Alec? Come on, buddy. He wants to dance with us. Ooh. I like you. Okay, we can dance together, I guess. We are, I mean, there's like no music, that's the problem. There's like no music out here, so. Can we dance to this? Yes, we can. Yes, we can. All right, she's dancing. Can we ask him to join? Let me just zoom on it. Oh, he pulled a newspaper out and everything. Oh no. <laughs> oh yeah, he's gonna come smussle with us. Come on out, come smussle with me, buddy. He's just like, okay, wacko. Oh no, he's joining in, that's right. Everybody smussle with me, smussle to him. What's his name? Jeff, Jeff, take it away, buddy. Yes. Do we have to like dance together? I mean, is this not enough? We're smussling, this should be awesome. Okay. I need to get the flirting going, you feel me? Because I want this date to be a fantastic, like a dream date. That's the goal, a dream date. So hopefully I can make this work. Work my magic. Let's see if I can do this. I wish it was this easy in real life. <laughs> it's not. Uh, we're going to admire him. Charm him again. And we will... How much money do you have? Okay, we'll ask him what turns him on. Oh, we have a crush on him as well. All right, we're gonna joke around with him. Oh my goodness, slow dance with Alec. I would if I could. I would if I could, girl. He wants to dance as well. Okay, we're almost at great. We're like in the great zone, but not quite there yet. We're getting there, we're getting there though. We're gonna tell him how much we like him. Okay. I guess we need to chat a little bit, share our interests, and badmouth him. We're not gonna do that. There's like a freaking dance team of smussling sims around us while we're flirting with Alec. No big deal, guys. There's just a huge, like, freaking squad of smusslers around us. They're like cheering us on right now. I love it. I love it. They're cheering us on. All right, we're gonna talk about travels with him as well. Come on, we're almost there, a great date. We're not really, but kind of close. <laughs> we didn't really like that, oh well. Come on, Alec. All right, oh, we can slow dance with him. Yay, does he still wanna dance? No, he doesn't. Buddy, Um, what is your problem? Can we come over here and hopefully sing with Alec now? Come on, Alec, come sing with me. It's like 4 a.m. in the morning. Oh, hello, Miss Linda. Maybe we'll have to give her a call. He's down! He's down! Yes. Hold on, let me really quickly turn the voice. Oh, not, not this. Let me turn the voices up. Is that, is that not it? Oh, hold on. Let me turn it back down. Maybe sound effects? Music? Oh, okay, that's definitely it. All right, guys, let's take a listen.
that was actually really cute. That was really cute. And I have like a really, I was thinking about it. So I think what I want to do is like, she accidentally gets pregnant with Mortimer's baby. And of course, Alec is not going to be happy about it, but they kind of want to work through it and hopefully be together. It shall be interesting because they already have crushes on each other. And then they're going to be like WTF when she's pregnant. It's going to be difficult, but we'll see what happens. Oh, and she wants to have a dream date with Alec. We're totally going to do it. We have 44 seconds left. We have to do it. We have to do it. Kiss him. Kiss him. <gasps> okay, we're almost there. We're almost there. Come on. We've got to get up there. Come on. It has to happen. We're so close. We have 25 seconds. Oh my gosh. We better. We better get there. <gasps> come on, come on, come on. No, we have like 15 seconds. Come on, please, game, please. We're so close. I don't want to play kick baggy. Come on. Oh my gosh. I'm not going to get it. Are you serious? I am so freaking close. No. It wasn't a dream date. I'm so mad. Oh my gosh. She called us baby. You're a great date, baby. We have to do this again. Oh my gosh. She called us baby. Little does he know we're about to have a baby. <laughs> Okay, well, this is very nice, if I do say so myself. I could ask him on another date, but I don't think I'm going to. Um, let's go ahead and... I wish they had a photo booth here. I would take photos in a heartbeat and hang them up on the wall, but I don't think they have it here. Which stinks. But I think we will document our love. So we're gonna go ahead and... Um, let me see. Have him take my picture. We're going to go and pose with a thumbs up. Like, my first date was awesome. Okay. My first date was awesome. <laughs> I could actually get him in it. There we go. Yeah. We'll get him in there. Ah, this is hard. Oops. No. Okay. We kind of got a minute, I guess. So I think I'm also gonna go ahead and end this part here. I hope you all enjoyed it. Don't forget to give this video a big fat thumbs up and subscribe if you would like to. I love you all so much and I'll see you all next time. Bye guys.